So iOS 16 has been out for a while now and I've been having one major issue. When I updated, the touch screen just didn't respond to anything, mainly to scrolling and stuff. So I've been having a lot of issues and it took me some time till I found out what it was. So I wanted to share what I learned about this issue. Apparently it's mainly on older iPhones, like I have an iPhone 10 and I wanted to show you how to fix it. So I want to show you what happens when I turn off the settings that you need to use. So now I have turned those off and I'm trying to scroll, I'm trying to go to control center, lock screen and nothing works. If I try to even go back, it works after a while, but you can see the scrolling just doesn't work. And you know, my phone is unusable because of that. So of course I wanted to solve this problem. When it first happened, it was when I updated to iOS 16.0. Then in iOS 16.0.2, they said that it's going to fix this problem on some devices, but it didn't. So the fact is that it says it addresses the issue on iPhones that have been serviced and my iPhone is renewed. So that may be the issue. I don't really know if they replaced the screen or not, but that might be the problem. So now I'm gonna show you how to fix it. So if you can, if it's even possible, because I had problems getting even into settings. So what you need to do is go into settings, accessibility, go into touch accommodations, turn that on, then turn on this tap assistance and set it to use in actual touch location. And you need to go down, go to swipe gestures, turn that on, and set it to standard. Now, your phone is usable, but there's this tap assistance gesture delay, which you can set to zero. So let me show you, if I try to type something, if I try to type fast, some letters will just not register. But you know, at least the phone is usable now. It's a little wacky, it's not as great, but at least your phone works. So come on, Apple, please fix this.